How's it going everybody? Mike here. I am right I am right now at the Marcy Town Center and I want to show you a glimpse of Marcy, New York and I'll tell you guys about. And yeah, you can see there's a huge puddle of water because we had the thing is is that um it started raining last night and then it rained this morning. And then shortly after this morning, it stopped. But um, I want to show you the history about Marcy Town Center because I grew up here. So um, back when Swish, Marcy Vet Clinic, Boom Fit, Center Stage, and Grippy's Hairstyling, it used to be, I believe, it used to be all one store. There used to be a nickel store back in the 1970s and early 80s when when I was, I wasn't around in the 1970s, but around the mid 1980s, that's when, that's when the Marcy Town Center had nickels, the supermarket, so. And there used to be a PNC at that time, I believe over there on the right near Four Seasons. So, things have changed for the last 30 years or so because I remember when there used to be a PNC there. But, um, Marcy Veterinary Clinic, they uh, started opening their doors about a year ago this month so it's been one year this month that they've opened up their store there's an there's a car coming so and then boom fit they opened their doors i'm gonna say probably probably last year it's a gym that a friend of mine goes to so uh she goes there That was a newer Duramax. Anyways, um, Boom Fit used to be, uh, I forget the name of the other place that closed um, when they already had it bought out. And then Swish used to be the dollar store, Family Dollar. This stupid camera can focus. So Swish used to be the uh, or the Dollar General, I mean, from 10 years ago or so. And they started opening a few other stores over here too. Now, Center Stage and Grippy's Hairstyling is a uh, mother-daughter owned business. So, Grippy's Hairstyling is the, the place I go to to get my hair cut. And if you check out their Facebook page, Grippy's Hairstyling and Center Stage, I highly recommend it. So, um, and I think I told everybody in a video at one point, but uh, that empty vacant place used to be up, uh, hold on. There's a neighbor down there. Anyways, um, that building right there used to be in Sears Flooring Outlet. Sorry about that, guys. But uh, anyways, that used to be in Sears Flooring Outlet from, I'm going to say, more than 10 years. But uh, they moved across the street from here. So Four Seasons and the post office are still up and running. But of course, the post office doesn't open on Sundays, so I usually go to Four Seasons to get. I usually go to Four Seasons to get pizza there, or from time to time, I would also go across the street to John's Pizzeria and get, you know, a slice of pizza and what have you to, over here. So not too bad. Next, I'll show you where Sears Flooring Outlet is now located when they made the move about two weeks ago or so. So, catch up with you in a bit, guys. 
So anyways, here's the new and Sears flooring outlet. And they started moving around, getting all their stuff together. And they made the parking lot a lot easier to, a lot easier to uh, park their cars and what have you. And this over there used to be a bank and it used to be, I'll see if I can go in a little closer. All right, guys. So anyways, there's in Sears flooring outlet and they moved about two weeks or so ago. And this over there used to be, it used to be a pizzeria place called uh, McGill's. And there used to be a car show over there, like in 2014 and 2015 when I started making YouTube videos. But they didn't make any good business over here, so they took their business elsewhere. And then over there used to be a bank, but, well, it used to be M&T Bank. Then it became the uh, Mohawk Valley Federal Credit Union, but they closed down too. So the only place that is currently open is in Sears Flooring Outlet. And it used to be, it used to be a muffin coffee place called My Favorite Muffin, My Favorite Bagel and Muffin. I used to go there all the time when it was over here and I would get I would get um I would get muffins, I would get coffee, you name it. And without further ado, I'll show you the other side of the building. Okay, so there it is. The new and Sears flooring outlet. So came out pretty good. And then there's the Ansira's shipping and receiving area right there. They wanted to build that up. So there's the van right there. All right. Let me know what everybody thinks in the video. Um, all right, you know the drill. Subscribe to me on the new channel. All right, take it easy.